Isaiah, obviously an interesting week for you matching up with your uh, your former teammates. What, what's this week been like for you so far? Uh, Well, you know, I've just been looking at it as a as a normal week, you know, even though I'm facing my teammate, you know, I don't want, I don't want to go in this game feeling like uh, I got to do this, I got to do that. It's, it's just a normal week. We just going to come out and face our opponent and anything like that. So. How often do you talk to those former teammates? <sighs> almost, almost every day, you know, those are still my boys on there. It's a couple of boys that I grew up with who still up there and everything, so. Have the coaching staff ask you about any points or t uh, tips or anything for the game plan? Nah, they haven't. <laughs> when you decided to come here, you know, that game was already on the schedule and things. Just the, the, the lead up to it, did you think about that? The fact that you were going to see the very, that, that, see your guys, I guess, later on? Uh, I mean, you know, that game was always circled just because I went there and everything. You know, it's going to be fun, you know, seeing my guys that I play with and everything like that. It's going to be competitive. I know they're going to be talking some smack, so I'm probably going to talk some smack back and everything like that. But it's going to be a good game. What have everything. they told you this week so far? Can you tell me anything? As, as far as the coaches? No, no, your, your former teammates. Oh, no, nah, they ain't tell me nothing so far. <laughs> well, I mean, they tell me stuff, but stuff I can't see on camera. <laughs> <laughs> so why was Mississippi State the right place for you? You had some other options, but why was this the right fit? Uh, you know, uh, Chauncey, Chauncey was a big influence on me choosing Mississippi State and everything like that. You know, me and him grew up together. Me and him played on the same part ball team, same high school team, you know, so we, we always put on the same team. So he said, you know, it will be fun again to play on on the same college team, finish off, finish our college career right off the right way. Now that you're here, what's this whole experience kind of been like for you? Uh, it's been a good experience, you know. Uh, I'm actually glad I chose Mississippi State. Everything, uh, they took me in with care. You know, you know the teammates. You know, they ain't never look at me wrong or anything, anything like that. You know, they brought me in with open arms and stuff like that. So. Everything you and, cool. and Tommy both show up under similar circumstances. What's it been like to kind of bond with a guy like him as, as newcomers to a, an existing roster? Tommy, you know, that's my boy. You know, we all going to share, like, similarities just because we came in, you know, we grad transfers and everything like that. So me and him talk, talk to each other every day and stuff like that. So, What's it like trying to get acclimated with a new set of receivers? Obviously, at Kansas State, you, get, you guys probably meshed really well and, and had good chemistry. You come here and – probably don't know any of these guys and, and you have to sort of fit into that room. What has that transition been like for you? It's been great. You know, like I said, everybody, they brought me on open arms, you know, I received a room, you know, we were, we were a really close-knit group, you know, we joke, we laugh every day, but when it comes to Saturday, you know, everybody means business. Yeah, now before you got some guys that uh, you practiced against for a couple of years in Manhattan that now will be trying to defend you, uh, will you be sending any uh, good-natured Smack talk their way before the ball game? Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, because they know me, you know, they, they already know I like to talk junk and stuff like that. So, you know, I mean, it's going to be friendly talking junk, nothing nothing too bad. You know, we still boys, we still cool, so it's not going to be, like, too personal or anything like that. We don't know about your teammates, but Coach Schneider <clears throat> is famous for keeping in touch with people. Have you spoken with him as well? Uh, I actually have not spoken to Coach Schneider since I changed since Kansas State, so. Win, lose, or draw, are you kind of looking forward to post game talking to your guys? And things? Oh, yeah, of course. You know, after the game, you probably see a big smile from my face, big smile from their face. You know, win, lose, or draw just because I'm seeing my teammates, seeing my old friends, and everything like that. So it's a little different deal, too, because you played against Mississippi State last year. What, what do you kind of remember about that experience? What was it like playing against Mississippi State? Physical, uh, physical game. We knew that when we play Mississippi State, it's going to be a tough game. You know, we're going to have to come with it. You know, these boys, they're not going to let up and everything like that. So, hopefully the same way this year. How are they kind of – you were on that – you were in that losing locker room last year. So, what, what's their mindset right now coming in thinking about, you know what, trying to go even this thing up and get some revenge? I can't answer that. <laughs> you know, I don't, I don't play with Kansas State, so I don't know how they think you right now. <laughs>